Hi everybody, welcome back to Xenoverse. Uh, last time we ended off, we were stuck in this route right here. Uh, we're gonna make our way through it now. Uh, I actually have something I wanna do. I wanna add a new member to the team. Ooh, ooh, mysterious. Uh, so if you're excited for today's episode, go ahead and drop a like. Uh, don't be shy, we're in episode 12 now. Having a great time in the series. Hello, you made me, you made my steed uh, witness such a terrible accident. Look at, it ain't my fault. I'm going to kill your steed. Bye bye. I should probably start training on Lex a bit because Gigamoro's kind of taken over. Yay, our favorite person. Let's steal some fucking shit from the merchant. Six out of 11, we're getting there, baby. Love collecting these rare candies. I was fixing to get Diddles asleep, but you decided you had to get in my way. Dude, why are you trying to make your kid sleep out in the open? Why is your kid called Diddles? Okay, this thing's cry is fucking loud. Like louder than every other cry in this game. I used Thrash just because I wanted to do quick, easy damage. And of course they have a fucking ghost type in the back. Hey, they always make jokes about my name and I will shut their mouths in battles. Mammy Mammy. That's actually kind of a hard ass name. I like that name a lot. A Ganlon Berry. No idea what that does. Oh, a good rod. You want a Kadoon? What? Why? They're so common. What's this? Don't worry, come inside. I'm big and tall. I won't eat you. Me. Oh yeah, I can rest here, right? Yeah. I took a walk in the woods and it came out taller than the trees. I don't know what that means. Dude, I forgot this mon even existed, dude. This fucking roadkill ass mon. Bye bye. I wish I wasn't such a bitch about fucking fairy types and shit, because, man. I don't know, part of me wishes I, I started off with a water starter, because I got curious and I actually looked up uh, what the starter evolutions are, like the other ones. And the water starter looks fucking amazing. I think the water starter is actually my favorite one design wise. But I think the water starter is sound type, right? I don't know, I just kind of got spooked by sound type. And yeah, so I don't know. I'm not sure how I feel, I don't know. But then I feel like I have to have a starter on my team. Like I would totally get rid of my starter, right? Cause I'm not that attached to it personally, but it's like plot, you know, it's like plot related, right? So it's like, can I even get rid of it? If you guys think I can get rid of it, then sure I might, but like, you know. Anyways, hi Pleon City. Uh, oh, it's Kelly. Um, remember me, you're number one fan? That's weird. Anyways, welcome to Hyperly on City. It's music heaven. Um, if my hunch is right, I'd say you came to the to snag a badge, don't you? Ha, <laughs> I know, uh, you like the back of my hand. But, you see, you couldn't have chosen the worst day to come here. I'll have you know, uh, that all the activities in town and gym challenges included will be suspended due to a big event that Wallace Daddy is going to hold here tomorrow. Bro. Really? You know nothing about it? It's been everyone's lips lately. Do you live in this universe, maybe? Tomorrow, Wallace Daddy, Eldu's most acclaimed singer, is going to perform just to present his new song. Uh, what does this have to do with the gym being closed for challengers? Well, Daddy, other than being super famous among young fans for his music, is also a renowned trainer. He simply owns uh, City Gym Leader, do you see now? Oh, I had an idea. Uh, the gym won't host trainers for a while, so I have nothing better to do than stay here twirling my thumbs. So how about we do a little tour of the city? Come on, come with me. I'll be your guide in wonders. Okay, sure. I guess a guide helps. Uh, okay. There's some graffiti on the walls. I respect that. I actually fucking like that a lot. That's cool. There's just a fucking open road that we walk on. Apparently that's, you know, just casual walking on an open road. Oh, there's a fucking mega low bunny. Yep. Okay. Now uh, this building, then, um, nothing less than the hip top store, a uh, fashion brand renowned in all of Eldu. The clothes you see here on display are part of daddy's branded collection. He's, uh, the brand's creator. Um, if you like compulsive shopping, this is the perfect place for you. Keep an eye on how much you spend though. Nothing cheap here. Enough with the chit chat. Let's proceed with our tour. We're here, Cali. And I've arrived at the Hypleon City's heart, the concert square. Uh, as you can see by the crowd, you can guess this is where Great Wallace Daddy's going to perform. If I'm being honest, I'm also a uh, big fan of his. I can't wait to see the show begin. Forgive me. I'm so excited that I got quite away. Uh, let's see about walking. Okay. So the Pokemon I wanted to add to my team, I just double checked. I actually can't get it until I beat the gym. Maybe that'll give you as a hint of who I want to use on the team. Oh! Oh my god, Scraggy! Um, this is Hypleon's rail station. This is where um, Quasar Express departs for Westar City, where you can admire uh, the incomparable sunset on the rocky heights of Sunflower Canyon. As you see, it's covered in murals. Don't worry. Um, this stylistic choice is part of the general atmosphere you can perceive in town. It's not abandoned, although it seems like it's out of order due to a breakdown. Do you have anything to do with it by chance? Why would you ask that? Like, what, what type of... I, what? I, I get him the main character, but holy shit. And this, uh, we're finally here, Hypleon's, uh, city's gym, where Wallace Daddy's abode. Uh, at the top is a skyscraper. There's this golden studio where Daddy arranges all of his adi al albums. More so, uh, moreover, inside, the most talented artists under the gym's leader's wings are going to challenge you uh, to the beat of music. Too bad you'll have to wait until you can prove yourself here since the gym is closed. But there's a surprise. To celebrate tomorrow's event, Daddy has set up a buffet for the whole town. We have charged to boot. Uh, what a golden boy. Quite literally. Uh, I won't be able to see you at work and cheer for you, uh, but I'll be more than glad to partake in the feast. Come on, let's get in. What the fuck? Welcome. Uh, this buffet has been arranged by Mr. Daddy's kind behalf to promote his new song coming out tomorrow. You may serve yourselves and remember that everything is free of charge. Is that 
an Instagram? Wait, look at uh, all, all the delicacies. If you don't mind, I'm going to dig in, Callie. Wait, can I scan that on my phone? Let me do this. Let me do this real quick. It actually opens up Instagram and it takes me to <laughs> Wallace Daddy's Instagram. That's actually fucking hilarious. Guys, I need you to do this. Look at this. I guess I'll follow Wallace daddy. Yo, it's my guy. Whoa, these sweets look delicious. Yum. Guys, you should try these cream puffs. They're damn delicious. Excuse me. There were no sweets arranged. Was there a change of plans? Since they've already been served, so be it. You may save yourselves freely. What the fuck? We're not meant to have dessert. What the fuck? They wolfed them. Mr. We really saw you couldn't eat anything. Please accept this as an apology. Sick. Please forgive those for the inconvenience. Those sweets look delicious. Whatever, Callie, it's time to go. What is that? <laughs> okay. I guess because there's like a day night cycle event, they want, I guess they want him to do it. Is all they have to say is those sweets were delicious, really? Yeah, I guess they want this guy to carry me. <sighs> that hit the spot. Too bad for the desserts, but no big deal. Callie, you must be tired of such a long day. Uh, must be hard to live as a trainer, huh? I know just the place you can rest as much as you want. Come with me. Yeah, this must be the. Yeah, I get it. I'm loving all the graffiti, bro. I love it here. What the hell is this? This symbol house is all for you and your Pokemon. Come on, make yourself at home, get comfy, go to sleep, your heart's content, amazing bed, oh, I have to go, wouldn't want to be out of energy for tomorrow, I uh, suggest taking a nice nap yourself, but if you want to take a more stroll, feel free to do that, anyway, sweet dreams, I swear this isn't a joke about the buffet, what the fuck, oh, well, I guess I'll sleep, you should head towards the concert square, okay, can do, wouldn't want to miss it, bro, what's this, lemonade, bruh, imagine digging through the trash and picking up lemonade, why, Wait, hold on, let me get off the board real quick, why, oh, here we are, hey, hurry up, it's about to begin, oh, nearly missed it, I wonder what music's actually gonna play, hey, how that's not good. That's not a good announcer. That's not a good megaphone sound effect. Uh, I mean, I guess it's not bad. Hey, Hyphleon. Yeah, it's not really good, is it? Hey, Hyphleon City. Yeah, it's not really a good effect either. Fuck it, just read it normally. So, are you hyped? Could be. Oh, yeah. Put your hands up for Wallace Daddy. My man just appeared. Okay. Yo, dogs, what's up? All right, ready to smash this place? You cool with that? Then I want a yeah out of you. Oh, come on. You can do better than that. Oh yeah, that's the real deal. Now, that you're all fired up, we're ready to drop the bomb. You're here for what's new hit. If you're here for the new hit, ain't ya? Yeah, partner, lay down the beat. Okay. Okay. Where's this going? What a terrible stomachache. Wait, what? What the f- Oh, is it the buffet? It was the buffet. That it was the buffet, <laughs> but it was so charged up. Yeah, it must be it. New hit was an epic fail, but why? There's still someone down there. So it was someone who liked it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Sorry for the interruption, but we thought that no one, um, there was no one left. I want, I really want to know such dedicated fans' names. Uh, I'm a really big fan of yours as well as the city's guide for this event. Uh, oh, cool. What about you, Ali? And you're a trainer. I'm out of this world, buddy. Uh, I'd give you both an autograph, but this left mess me with a bad taste, and I don't think it's because of the gold. I never it happened before. People leave my concerts. I think I'll need to digest this failure. Uh, I don't think spectators ran away because of the song. What'd you say? Uh, I don't think they ran away because the song was bad. Uh, you see, for this day, a big buffet was arranged um, at the gym's ground floor. A buffet that wasn't supposed to have desserts. Well, I know we set that thing up with, uh, with my trope to publish the event. But I'm not following you. Let me explain, sir. Contrary to arrangements, there were sweets on display. And not even the planners knew where those came from. I still don't get it. What I'm saying is someone may know who put those sweets there, which were probably bad. Oh, incidentally, neither me or Callie had any. We were perfectly fine. Then what are we waiting for? Let's go to the gym and try and get something out of this. Wait, what? Okay, I guess I'm going to the gym now. That took a weird turn. I saw everything with my own eyes. A weird purple Pokemon put those sweets on the counter while the cooks were distracted. A purple Pokemon, you said? A purple Pokemon? Like that one over there? What Pokemon? What Pokemon? Hello? Uh, this is a bit of a long ass pan. Oh my fucking God. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, that's it. I'm sure of it. But when did it become so huge? Beats me. I just know I'm going to make it pay. I saw something like that in a movie and I want to, uh, I'm going to go make a phone call. Okay, bye. Kyle, you said you were a trainer. I won't really mind if you won't, but if you want to help, I would really appreciate it. Make up your mind quickly and meet me at the gym's roof. Well, Mr. Wallace, uh, Mr. Daddy, we're going to assist the poisoned people. If it's not a problem, I'd like to go with Daddy. I can't miss him in action. All right, my friends, let's go. That creep's going to regret attacking my city. Okay, interesting. A fucking large ass slurpuff i wonder if this was conceptualized before Dy dynamaxing like surely it was right dude this game is just predicting everything is this the roof or no oh yep this is the roof pog hey Callie, come over here oh okay uh you do you decided to help me then uh the more nailing this oversight noob the merrier until uh unity is strength nah dude jesus christ 
You know, Daddy, I've never seen this kid backing out of something ever since I met her. Oh, yeah. By the way, uh, where the heck are those bastards? Hey, watch your mouth. God, is it? What the f? Try to say that one more time and we'll get uh, you'll get a punch in your ugly mug. Got it? Ah, what up, Minta? I see you're always in good shape. But, but enough with the plies and trees. Let's get to work. Oh, hey, Squirt. It's here as well. Callie, I didn't see you there. Sorry. Nice to see you again. I'm glad these are reoccurring characters. I like these guys. So you already know each other. That's crazy. Uh, we've just met each other. Seems like that Pokemon is fed up with our chatter. And so the uh, player, uh, sorry, the players probably. All right. Don't worry. Geist and uh, is a, a quee to help you. I don't know what that means. <laughs> Chrysler, it's time for the introductions. Hi, Captain. Revolver, initiate introduction protocol. Oh, shit. That's re oh, they changed Revolver. High-tech weapon created by cybernetically modifying the system of the Team Dimension Masterpiece of Engineering. I have to say that hacking the system was all but easy even for me, but it wasn't impossible. It wasn't all but easy. After altering the mother code, the work has uh, was more than worth it. You always have to make things longer. In short, we now have an automated ghost catching weapon on our side. Awesome. Um, I didn't get much, but it looks dope as heck. Wrecking this monster will be a piece of cake. I feel like something's gonna go wrong. Let's catch this gigantic ghost. Wait, it's a ghost? Okay, I'm always on fire girl uh, come on will show cali your progress with the kid gun yeah yes yeah, sir sis <laughs> chrysler is revolver catching system ready yet affirmative okay revolvers one once this weekend you have to trap all oh, that goes all right i'm gonna have to fight it aren't i why aren't our weapons working? Uh, I was about to tell you, but you're so caught up in the moment. Daddy must have omitted this detail, but I think that Pokemon isn't a ghost type. Rather, since it's sweets, poison citizens, it's probably a poison type. <laughs> Santana, are you dumb? We are the Geist. Our job is catching G-H-O-S-T type Pokemon. As in, the name suggests. We came here for nothing. Sorry, it's just that when I saw Big Fella, I thought about that movie with the giant monster and... <laughs> did you take us for actors? We don't have time to waste with this nonsense. Dude, this Slurpuff will kill us. Bro, what? Oh boy, those idiots were nailed. Uh, they got blown up in that flash. All right, Callie, I guess it's up to you now. Let me see what you're made of. Okay. Holy fuck. Big ass fucking Slurpuff. Can I catch this? Bring on the boss Pokemon. Okay, it's a poison type. Oh my god, it's actually huge. I love this. It's genuinely massive. Okay, I guess I'm just gonna thrash and just do damage. I don't really have anything else. Oh my god, it did nothing! It did nothing! God damn! And it's got poison touch. Dude, this thing's fucking huge. I don't think its design changes that much to where I care about using it. Um, but you know, it's cool. I suppose it's 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 a big fucking slurp off. Bye bye. I guess this is where Gigamoro comes in. I'm so glad I made you level 50. My big beautiful bird. Fuck, I didn't mean to use Thief. I want to use Bone Meringue. Let's go. Boom. Boom. Decent amount. Yeah, the fact that it's got Dream Punch is very annoying. But it doesn't heal that much, so I guess it's okay. Bone Meringue again. Bye bye. Yeah. Fuck your HP. It's got so much of it though. So much HP. Get another Bone Meringue on the go. Please use something stupid. Okay, that's Pog. How, how did you miss? Poison type shouldn't miss Toxic. I guess they didn't add that feature in this game. Cool. All right, last HP bar. That's fine. Gigamoro has done all it has to do. Thank you, Gigamoro. You're amazing. Who's next? Shufi, I guess. Uh, we have Iron Head now. Fuck it, let's go. I, I probably can get rid of Home Claws. Oh my fucking god. Did not expect that one to come, but it makes sense. Whiplash, this might be your last job. As This might be one of your last jobs, bro. This might be one of your last jobs. Let's just retaliate. Fuck it, dude. That did nothing, dude. Holy shit. That did nothing. Genuinely nothing. Hi, jump kick. Resisted, I know, but like, yeah. You know what? It might be time to retire Whiplash. Big Uzi, come on, my man. Lava Plume. Wait, Low Kick might do a lot, actually. I guess it's too late to find out now. Dude, this thing is a fucking menace. I'm. Jesus Christ. It's pretty cool though that all my mons got some action though. Bye bye. Is it gonna go back down to normal size? Wait, fuck, I forgot I could have probably caught it. Yeah, whatever. I didn't really want to catch it anyway. Wait, maybe I can now. Cause yeah, it wouldn't have gone down to small size. I don't know. Uh, what the hell? The tub has become so tiny. It's obviously that wasn't real form. Otherwise he would have sneaked into the gym. Must have turned into a joint after absorbing energy through those mysterious sweets. Uh, you're legit a genius. Um, all right, it's time to make this little bastard pay for uh, Is he crying? That that is a sad cry, not a defeated one. Hey little guy, tell me. You like music? Is that why you've come to this town? Oh wow. Can't blame you. But then why What? What the hell are you doing? Don't worry. This using clear smog move, it seems like it wants to make amends for what it's done. Uh really? So you aren't a bad guy after all. Oh, I get it now. Um, you only wanted to help, but you didn't know those sweets were poisonous for us humans. Oh, that's cute. Uh, when I was busting and moving Alola, a man working in a Malasada shop told me that someone who can cook can't be a bad guy. And you know, uh, wouldn't you know, that kiosk sign had a Slurpuff on it. All right, I made my decision. Listen, Slurpuff, would you like to join my team? 
Oh, well. <laughs> These things that only someone who lived in the hood can get. When you're alone, all by yourself, you just need a little push to feel part of a group. And music is something that unites people. Am I right, little guy? I wonder if he's going to use Slurpuff when we battle him. But you can't catch this Pokemon with a regular ball because it's not from Eldu, but from another. <laughs> I never said I was going to uh, close in a Pokeball. This fella looks like a tough guy. A free spirit. And uh, what's that you said? It's not from Eldu? It's one more thing we have in common then. Fair. I found a new brother thanks to you, Kelly. You said that you're a trainer, so I suppose you came here to tussle me at the gym, nah? All right. Challenge accepted. Although you can't aim for the top from the get-go. Uh, just like the music biz, you got to start from the bottom in my gym as well, so... Uh, let's go, Noivern. Bring them back to the bottom of the building. Um, bye, buddy. See you later. Oh, Callie, you almost had me um, landed on my head there. Rumors about your um, misadventures with that Pokemon are already spreading the town. Uh, we as members of the staff managed to take care of the citizens, although, to be honest, they just got their strength back all of a sudden. It was undoubtedly your doing, so I thank you in the name of the whole city. Um, now that the threat has been thwarted, you will be able to challenge Mr. Daddy. But first, you better heal your Pokemon in the gym. Uh, challenge requires the best of your ability. Uh, the staff will be glad to welcome you as uh, explained how to tackle the challenge whenever you're ready. I'll be, wa I'll be waiting for you. Okay, cool. Time to take on the gym, I suppose. Friend, Daddy loves music so much that he decided to honor an entire city with it, funding the project all by himself. Dude, fucking rich. What do you do? Uh, the best artists are the ones with a troubled past. It's a fact. Dude, we got bands, bro. If I hadn't subscribed to the fan club, I never would have known that daddy comes from Alola. It's fucking cool. I was zooming by on my board up and down the block and I lost my groovy glasses. Oh, they're probably hidden items somewhere. Did I have like an item finder? I don't remember. All right, well, I decided I'm not going to keep it a secret any longer. Uh, I want to replace this guy. I don't know if it's the best idea. I don't know. I guess it's not bad. I already have two mons that can take on steel types, which is like one of the most threatening types in the game. So so bye bye. Give me black this black belt. I'll put you in the uh, the cool guy box though. Yeah, I want to use Eevee. I want to use the uh, sound evolution, which you actually can get after beating the gym. So dude, it's jolly. I I I feel like fuck, dude. I'm gonna look up the evolutions stats. I feel like jolly's not gonna be good for it, but fuck it, whatever, dude. I'm just I'm just gonna accept that I'm unlucky with natures. But yeah, before I evolve it, I'm just gonna let it gain some levels. Although clothing store, what's going on in here? Can we customize our character? I actually don't know. I feel like what's the point of a clothing store if you can't, you know? But welcome to the hip top store. Thank you. I love these hashtag hip top designer bags. I see. Thanks. I said I I I I was rude to this person and said the glasses didn't suit them, and I got choice bags. Brilliant. Nowadays, appearance is everything. That's why I only wear hip top from head to toe. These clothes aren't for me. I'd like some vintage pieces. Oh, yeah, there's Sound Pledge. But you gotta, you gotta. Oh, wait, do I not have to beat the fucking gym leader then? Or I don't know. Cool, fuck it, whatever, dude, I'll take Sound Pledge. The, the guide I'm reading says that you have to beat the gym leader, but I guess not. Fuck yeah, maybe they changed that, I don't know. Let me go level EV up then, I suppose. I'm really mad though, because I really want to get a fucking, a non-jolly one, dude. I'm so sick of having shit-natured Pokemon. And there we go, let's go, we're getting the Sound Evolution. I'm here for it, dude, I want to use the Sound Evolution. It looks like this. I actually quite like its design. Bandion. Vibri is actually a really good name for it. And of course, yep, it's a special attacker. So uh, love the fact that I actually have a one that drops a special attack. I love that for me. That is so awesome. I'm not a huge fan of evolutions, but if you add a new one, yeah, sure, I'll try it and check it out. Uh, to be honest, I, I might give these choice specs to, uh, to Big Uzi here. I feel like... Specs Uzi could like do some damage. Anyways, I guess time I should take on the gym, right? Uh, maybe I should explore the city first though. I guess I'm not in a rush anymore now that I have the EV. Daddy's not only gonna record breaking singer, but also a showman and a model. He just does it all, doesn't he? One EV, yep, yep, I already did that. <laughs> hey, hey, you looking for trouble? No. All I ever wanted, I achieved it. Now it's a life dream that I can split. I can't split. It's one of my favorite daddy bars. A flute would be perfect on this track. Can you play it? Yeah, probs. And we can't go upstairs. Daddy had a performance, I performed in my city last year, but I missed it. I'm not gonna do the same this time. And you believe that daddy was once poor? I mean, he used to steal from Pokemon for a living. Well, I'll be damned. Each daddy track is catchy that I can't help humming it. Dude, I wanna hear some of this guy's music. I don't have the best sense of direction, but graffiti uh, helped me not get lost. Awesome. TMO5 Roar. Who the fuck threw this away? Not sure big dancing is for me. No, not like that, you freaking bonehead. One, two, one, two, then three. What's going on in here then? Been walking my scalp every day to be flawless. I may have lost uh, my hair, but not my style. Dude, same. I'm gonna make these dishes shine brighter than his scalp head. Wallace Daddy has a real gold addiction. Do you think he'd look something like something like this? I like the fucking graffiti so much, man. I want my, my, my room to be like this. I want my room to have like brick walls and graffiti, bro. The bus is late again. It would help if there was actual moving cars. Cars. Who lives here? Nobody. So weird. He just let me sleep in a random house. Guest house. Thought it was gonna be a fucking hotel, but I guess not. My boyfriend thinks more about Wallace Daddy than me now. Geez, TV's not working when the best report about Daddy's new album is on. Do you want to see my vinyl collection? 
Sure. Rags to Riches, Red Sun, All Lights on Me, Top Dog, Savage, King of the Jungle, and finally, Wonderful TM24, but you can have it for listening to me. Is that Thunderbolt? Let's fucking go, dude. I'll take it. This is why we talk to people. Give me that Thunderbolt. Who learns Thunderbolt on my team, though? Nobody. <laughs> I've got such a scuffed team. Bone Daddy since the first album. No, that was rap. Oh, yeah, back in the day when his old stuff was better. Sorry, mate, but you won't get through here. Uh, we're working on new stuff. What's going on in here? My friend arranged an intervention for me. I love that hat. His wedding planning is driving me insane. Moving the hype on his best thing could have done i found great friends here that pokemon i've always wanted to see is le legend wait for it dairy legendary why shall i ever meet my soulmate what why are you doing up here just saying shall i ever meet my soulmate are you good do you follow daddy on instagram too yeah you only reach uh, for the stars through hardships and these are the symbol of daddy's efforts oh yeah like yeah that's cool he's admitted this but now i have all the inspiration um what did the art teacher always say when you have no ideas and want to draw fall back on fruits i've only had a nice fruit to sketch this is street art a space available for everyone who want to dabble the graffiti really weird it seems some graffiti has moved somewhere else meh maybe it's just a hunch is this it oh this is a pokemon holy shit oh my god talk hackle dude i want it oh my god oh my god oh my god so i did some looking up Apparently this thing respawns in this house every day and it gave me a different color. Cause yeah, I remember seeing this thing in a bunch of different colors. Uh, I'm gonna look at it right now. It can be blue, purple, uh, yellow, red, or green. To be honest, I think the yellow one looks nice, but the purple one looks like the official one. I don't know, the green one's really cool too. I think, I'll, yeah, I, think I like the purple one most. I'm not just saying that cause that's the one on screen. I actually like the purple one. Do I wanna use it though? I'm tempted. It's probably a poison type though, which I already have Shufi. But if this thing, oh, it's gonna be a, ooh, is it gonna be like a sour? type if that's oh it's like tox look at his tail dude i don't know we'll see oh wait is it even a poison type it might just be a sound type huh do i definitely want to use an evolution then because i feel like everybody uses an evolution and you know me i'm kind of a hipster lax is trying to learn dragon dance before it learns any actual fucking dragon moves whatever i'll take it uh yeah it's just a pure sound type uh purple paint uh, it's not graffiti. That's a Pokemon. It mixes up in city walls and mocks anyone who comes this way. I feel like I fuck. I should use a Mon like this because it's like right up my alley. It's a lizard and it's graffiti. It's literally made for me, right? Fuck. I'm so. I'm so tough. I'm so. Guys, I don't know who. Who would? I don't know who would you guys rather I use? I've got no fucking idea. We're gonna call this Brennan. Thank you so much for being a member for 15 goddamn months. I'll send it to the PC for now. If it has a better nature than than Evolution, I might add it because I really want to use a sound type because sound is a new type, right? And that's cool. Uh, and you know, Evolution. She's cool, but ooh, tough choice for me. It's literally a fucking graffiti lizard. Like that is literally like Hoodlum Callum the Pokemon. Uh, oh wow, it's actually, it looks like a physical attacking Pokemon. I could be wrong, but I mean, it's special attacks Lord and it's got more physical attack, but simple is an ability too, which is pretty fucking cool. Those many people believe that graffiti are vandal stuff, but that ain't true. When you leave graffiti here in Icleon, um, you do nothing but leave your uh, indelible sign in the city. Yeah, okay. I love the Scraggy. I wanna see if it spawns back or, yeah, okay, it just looks like a daily event. I guess if I change my day forward, would it register as a new day? Huh, I guess not. Maybe I need to reset my game? All right, reset the game. Let's see. There is not another one here. Hmm. Oh, shit. Okay, it's it appeared in a different spot. Did I just not notice it? What the fuck? Okay, it's a green one. This one's kind of cool too. I mean, I like them all. I don't know. I might catch a bunch of them and try and get like a good natured one. Does crunch kill? It doesn't. Okay, good to know. I kind of want the yellow one because yellow is literally like my favorite color ever. So even though it doesn't look the best, I want it. I also want to check out their like stats and stuff. All right, let's see. Yeah, there's another green one. Maybe it's depending on the date. Let me try changing it to the 16th. Do I even have to reset? Let me leave and enter. Uh, no, I don't even have to reset. Holy shit. Okay, if we get a red one, that's really convenient. If I leave and enter again, I get a yellow one, just like I wanted. Pog. <laughs> I can walk on him. Okay. Hello, friend. Ah, oh, fuck. I killed it. Ah, oh, come back. Yay. I guess you can shiny hunt it quite easily like that then. I think the shiny one's white. I think I saw someone... I was looking at like, you know, just posts about it on Reddit. And I think I saw someone show that they got a shiny one. You know, prove to me you love me. I'm going to put you in a, in a luxury ball. Fuck you. All right, let's go check these lizards out. The only ones we were missing is the blue one. I didn't bother catching the red one. But I want to use the yellow one. I think purple does actually look better. The green, I don't know. They all look nice. But yellow is like my signature color. So, you know, I've got to represent. Let's see. What nature are you? Neutral. 
I fucking take that. It does appear to be more of a physical attacker though, which is very strange because people were talking about it using like fake tears and nasty plot. So I mean, I, people are saying it only gets uh, nasty plot by egg move as an offensive boosting move, which doesn't really bother me. I'd probably rather use it physically anyway. I don't know. I don't know. What do you guys think? I might replace it with uh, with the, the newly added evolution already. Because you know, I, I feel like it's like more. It's more me as a Pokemon. Let's check out the green one real quick. Okay, yeah, you're also simple. What item does this one have? Oh, a person berry? Okay, cool. Cool. Yeah, I'll take it. Fuck it, dude. I'm happy with the new team member as much as, you know, I might I might eventually use the evolution if this thing doesn't pull its weight. So, you know, I'll, I'll put it in the cool box for now, but I'm quite happy with uh, with my edgy graffiti lizard. Anyways, um, I'm going to call it there. Uh, I don't really feel comfortable doing two gyms back to back, and I feel like this gym challenge is going to be long as fuck. So, thank you guys so much for watching episode 12. Uh, stay tuned for episode 13. We're going to take on uh, the sixth gym. Dude, I'm excited. You guys are too. Appreciate you, and have a good rest of your day. Uh, bye bye.